G'day Australian floorball fans. Welcome to Roscoe and Toma on tour. I'm Toma and I'm Roscoe and we'll be taking you behind the scenes of the Australian women's floorball team with some player profiles and updates now that the girls have started their World Floorball Championships campaign here in Finland. <laughs> day two. It is day uh, two. Day two of training camp. But Toma and how do you think the girls are settling in? Look, Roscoe, I think it's pretty good so far. There's been some good team bonding. Um, the feeling out on the court has been pretty calm. I think everyone's just sort of uh, playing it safe at the moment, but you know, again tonight, that'll be interesting. So yeah, look, I think it's been good. There's been some really good activities. Last night was probably a highlight so far. The sauna and the ice ice lake, that was, that was fun. Yeah, no, no, that was definitely a highlight. I think especially for many of the girls like myself, first time on tour, um, first time playing floorball in uh, winter country as such so I guess yeah the, the activities are a little bit different um yeah rocking up to negative to negative temperatures and um sitting in a sauna and jumping in a freezing cold yeah. lake it's a little different to what how we do it in Australia but yeah definitely we would call that uh, an ice bath back home but a frozen lake uh, I guess similar thing and would do the trick so yeah no look it's going really well so far coming up later we're going to be interviewing one of our new up-and-comers Yazzy Skeen, hashtag Yazzy1322, that is Y-A-Z-Z-I-E 1322 if you guys want to follow Yazzy on Instagram. And I'm sure young Yazzy's an all-rounder, so we look forward to uh, hearing from her a bit later on. Yeah, we've also got a local game, our first practice game run out tonight, hashtag Fosu. Um, that will be a good one to see how we play as a team and, and for our coach Grant Mead to, to see how everyone's playing together, so that should be good fun. Yeah, definitely. I think everyone's really looking forward to that. It's been pretty relaxed so far, camp. So it'll be uh, interesting to see if the Aussie girls go out hard tonight. So that's all from us now. Hashtag as cool as Blaze Hodges. <laughs> Hashtag follow Jess Rose on Facebook. Hashtag girls play floorball. Hashtag respect or fear none. Hashtag, Hashtag magical, magical together. together. Welcome back to Roscoe and Toma on tour. We're really excited now. We've got one of the young up and coming players for the Australian floorball team, Yazzie Skeen. Thanks for being with us. <laughs> Yazzie, welcome to the show. Um, welcome to Finland. Thanks. Uh, we know this is your first time overseas. Were you expecting to see snow here? Uh, I was expecting to see snow, probably not this much though, but it's good. Now, Yazzie, how long have you been playing floorball? Uh, I've been playing floorball for about three years now, but I've only been playing competitive for about a year. Jumped onto the scene at AFO earlier this year in the Gold Coast in the yeah. development team, yeah? Yeah, it was heaps good. That was probably my best experience so far. Hashtag honest. heaps good. <laughs> Hashtag AFO. Um, Yazzie, what is your following like back home? You got some fans? Um... Yeah, it's good. All my family keep messaging me and trying to call me and everything. So it's really good to keep in touch with them. They're heaps good. And everyone back from the club, they're all backing me and everything, so it's heaps good. Yep. Yeah. And is there anyone that you want to shout out to in terms of like has helped you with your training or your support on the way? Uh, pretty much a shout out to my family, mum and dad, he heaps good. Uh, Alan, for all <laughs> Alan for all the training and Julie for everything you've done and everyone else who's helped me get here. Fantastic. So that's Peninsula yep. Global Club. Well done guys. Um, are you looking forward to signing some autographs? Apparently floorball is Pretty big deal over here, a bit bigger than Oz. You've been practicing yeah. your autographs? Um, like, ever since I've been young, I've always wanted to come over and sign autographs. It's been, it's been my thing. <laughs> so, uh, the last few months, I've just been practicing signing my name, got my number after it, and everything. So, fantastic. Yeah. Number 28, look out for that one. And we've been doing a lot of hashtags on our show so far, which is crazy because we've only been going for about two minutes. <laughs> Uh, do you have a hashtag that you use? Uh, I'd say hashtag NXE. I'm going to tag all my stuff with that. Yeah. Wait that one is out. That, is, that, is that your last name spelt backwards with a Y on the end? It is. Okay, yeah. guys. So Good if you want to follow Roscoe. Yazzie, and that's Yazzie, Y-A-Z-Z-I-E 1322 <laughs> on Instagram. Jump on. Give us some likes. Give us some follows. One, one final question. Of this whole trip, what's the one thing that you would like to achieve? I really want to get on the court and touch the ball. That's my first thing without falling over the boards. <laughs> so other than that, I think it's just going to be a really good experience. So you'll, you'll be able to do that tonight in a practice game? Yeah. yeah, that's going to be really good. I'm really looking forward to the practice game tonight. 
Yazzie, thank you so much for joining us. Anytime, um, nice. Good luck with your first game tonight. Thank you. Um, and everyone back home, remember you can follow the Australian women's floorball team with the hashtag respect all, fear none. See you guys. Hashtag magical together. G'day and welcome back to Roscoe and Toma on tour. We have just had our first friendly game and um, it was actually not a bad game. It was against uh, Fosu, who's a local team here, um, and the final score was 8-4 to Australia. So, good result. Good first win. Yeah. Good first win for the girls. Yeah. Um, we got with us tonight one of the veterans of the team, Jill Roberts. Hi. Hashtag skip. Hashtag skip. Um, so, Jill, thanks for coming along. Um, first question, I we'll guess we'll uh, get the serious ones done first. Okay. Did you um, cut your own fringe for the tour? <laughs> I had to, I'm afraid. Struggling with money, so like hairdressers aren't cheap. So yeah, this beautiful straight fringe was uh, cut by myself. That's for that. Okay. okay. Yeah, cool. Um, now, goals. Eight goals for Australia tonight. Um, you scored three of them. Now that, for, for people who know Skip, um, that's quite rare. She's usually uh, <laughs> the assist strange. girl. So three goals, that's a hat trick. Tell us about, about the game. What did you feel? How did you go? Yeah, I thought it was a really good game. Uh, I was quite nervous going in and I'm sure a lot of the new girls were quite nervous but as far as I'm concerned no one really showed that on the court. Everyone was gelling pretty well together from the very beginning and stepped up to everything that the coach asked them to do. So I think the result was end and yeah it was a lot of fun which I always think is the important part. So. Yeah it's good. So part of this tour we are obviously trying to promote floorball and yeah. get our players out there. You Do you have an Instagram? account that, that the guys can follow? I do have an Instagram account. It's uh, at Jill11. Yeah, Canadian way, J-E-Y-L-L -L, um, with the number 11 after it. Which is your playing number, of course. It is of my course. playing number. Love Fantastic. Number. All right, now, um, you are going to be, well, you are a already are, most capped Australian women's player. And, and this tournament, you should be hitting your 40th international cap, which is, which is, a, is a big thing. Um, is there anything over your career, have you, is there any highlights in that time that, you, that stu stood out to you? Um, my main highlights, probably my very first international game all these years ago. Just being on the court, being in the team was very exciting. And since then, biggest highlight, we may have lost the game, but Norway last world champs was probably uh, a team best as far as I was concerned and a personal best. So Now just a final, is there anyone you want to say hi to back home? Any thank yous? Any, I'll anything say, out yeah. to the fans? I'll say hi to my nieces and nephews, Emma, Miles and Lincoln. They know they'll support me from back home. I wish I had a family but I'm going to see them very soon as they come and watch. Uh, I'd like to thank Floorball Riders because they uh, brushed up my floorball skills before I joined the, with the rest of the team. They gave you that goal scoring stick. Gave they? me a goal scoring <laughs> ski, stick. So. And to everyone that supported me to get me here, um, go get funding page. Well, I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. And yeah, thanks for that. Thanks for joining us. I know it's a bit late and I know you've just had the ice late dip. <laughs> yes. So we'll Still let you go and get showered and uh, off to bed for a big day tomorrow. So thanks yeah. for coming in, Skip. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Hashtag as cool as Blaze Hodges. Hashtag girls play floorball. Hashtag it's just a game. Hashtag respect all fear none. Hashtag magical together.